Good afternoon, good evening, happy Friday to all the people out there. One thing that many people don't understand is it's not all about the money, you know. At the end of it, there's more intangibles that go into it. And, you know, I'm sitting here thinking about what it is that makes people successful. And there are certain ingredients that I've been able to come across that people don't really tell you about when it comes to success and in any type of business. And these ingredients are, I've seen, are fundamental, but they're not spoken about. Okay, number one is relationships. Okay, who you hang out with. Who you hang out with, the five people that you hang out with, determine who you will become or who you are, right? That's what the old saying says. So the average of the five people or the average of their incomes, the average of their personalities, whatever, is who you end up being. So be very careful as to who you hang out with, who you spend your time with, uh, and who you have relationships with. But once you do find those people that you do have, that are who you want to become, then it's important to build a relationship with them. And that leads to the next thing, All right? Number two, making it a win-win. So making it a win-win for you, making it a win-win for the other party, to where both parties end up getting what they want. And once you can do that, once you can figure out what the other party wants and get it to them, you getting what you want out of the transaction or deal is easy, okay? So making it a win-win, having a win-win mindset. Number three is doing more than what you're paid for. A lot of people do less than what they're paid for, especially if you, you know, have a job that you don't like or working at a place that you are very comfortable in. But when you do more than what you're paid for, not only does that show your character, but that also helps you become a better worker, become better at what you do. And ultimately, if you can provide more service and more, um, and do more than the other person, that can be the difference between you getting a client or getting a promotion, you know? So that's number three. Number four is pay attention who you listen to, right? Who is your mentor? Who is the person that is giving you the advice that you need, right? Who's looking over you and looking over your actions and able to tell you that you can do this, you can't do this, or this is a good idea, this is not a good idea. Pay close attention who you listen to and what they are telling you. And also pay, pay close attention to what the results are. Okay, do they have the life that you want? If they do, then okay, it's a, maybe it's a good idea for you to pay, pay close attention to them. If they don't, then be very wary of what they tell you. They may not give you the best advice. Number five, okay. This one is goes without saying, pretty obvious, but a lot of people don't talk about it. And that is taking initiative, okay. Taking action fast, not just taking action, but taking action fast, being able to, to get things done, okay, going out and getting it done. Um, a lot of people, that's very underestimated in this marketplace, in this environment, in, in the workplace. A lot of people, I mean, if, if you can move quickly, you are in an advantage because it takes, even with these big companies, the advantage with having, being a small guy is that you can move quickly. So the same thing applies with anything. You know, if you have clients, clients want to be responded in a timely manner. If you are working nine to five, your boss wants you to do a task in a timely manner. The faster you can do it, and more, and better you can do it, the efficiently you can do it, the more your value goes up. Okay, so again, just to recap. One, relationships and who you hang out with. Two, win-win mindset, having a win-win mindset. Three, doing more than what you're paid for. Four, paying close attention to who you listen to, getting a mentor that is 
someone that has your life or has what you want. And number five, take an initiative and taking that initiative quickly, taking action fast, all right? That being said, I'll leave you with that. If you have any more questions about anything, let me know. If you're looking to become wealthy, shoot me a DM. Come get, come join the table. We're accomplishing things that I've never thought I could. So I'm doing more and it's only just to be young. All right? See you later. Peace.